Hello everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to define functions and this along with the next tutorial on saving uh, files will also segue into the next tutorial so the next three tutorials including this one are um, all going to kind of connect together so make sure that you watch all of them it will make everything make a lot more sense to you and it will help you a lot in your uh, Python programming so to define your function, you're going to type in def space the name of your function. We'll do um, hello, and then you need to put empty parameters or parameters if you want to actually put something in there. We'll do colon enter. You need to put your indentation, and then we'll say print, and then hello. Now um, we have our function saved. So if we type in the name of our function, hello, like that, we get hello printed out on the screen for us. Um, you can also have it do, uh, you can have it take parameters and actually do something. So we can say def uh, add and then inside the paren um, parentheses we'll add the, paren uh, the parameters x and y and a colon of course enter indentation and then we'll say print x oops x plus y and enter twice now we have that in there if we do add and then uh, parentheses we put our numbers in there we'll do five and seven and we get twelve so as you can see it works perfectly it um, you can really do this with anything um, you can also add a doc string, which is like if you're going to use a function such as we can even I can even show you it right now. R this right here, usually you can put a doc string, which will explain how to do something. So to do that, when you're defining your function, we'll make this one uh, multiply. So def m u l i, then parentheses, and we'll say uh, x and y again colon enter and we'll say uh, we'll make three quotations and this is where our doc string starts you have to always make it at the beginning so we'll say this oops this function will multiply uh, the numbers given uh, and then you can type everything else you want down here and then to end it you just do your next three quotations press enter and then with the indentation just type in um, print x times y enter enter now it's saved in there so if we do uh, Moly, and then, oops, missed it. Like that, we get x, y, and then this function will multiply the numbers given. And since this is on a new line, without the indentation, it doesn't show. But if we were to indent, in, indent it, it would work. I believe, uh, I'll check just to make sure. Don't want to give you guys the wrong uh, impression. Make sure you know everything. And then, uh, you can also redefine things as well. Uh, this is a function, and then we'll do that. Oops. Hello. Uh, print x times y. Oops. Now we do this. Nope. Okay. So you have to keep everything on the same line up here, apparently. I thought you could make it go on the second line. I think I'm wrong. If you guys think that I'm doing something wrong that would allow you to put it on two lines, just tell me and, uh, yeah. Anyways, uh, just to show you, that actually does work. The function that I wrote. So we should get 20 when we get 20. Okay. So thank you guys for watching. I think this tutorial was a little longer than it needed to be. I'm sorry for that. 
Uh, like the video if you liked it, subscribe for future videos, and I am still trying to think of a uh, video to make for my uh, first 10 subscribers, so if you guys have any ideas for that, uh, put that in the comments section below, or go on my channel and enter that into the moderator module. Thanks again for watching, and I'll be seeing you later.